Hey guys, this is uh, Tony from uh, Florida. I just wanted to show you guys the uh, UAV I just built the past couple days. Never put a motor there before on a plane, but it seems to work out worked out pretty good. That's where I mounted the ESC. See, I just got a few barbecue skewers for. Uh, Whatever it is. Yeah, you know what I'm talking about. Got a light plywood motor mount that I built. Not sure that I needed it, but it works. And the pillar clears beautifully. As you can see, there's my 20 amp ESC. Poor guys, been through a lot. I'm going to get a new one. That's the battery placement, and uh, as as you can see, you can't adjust it, so everything's set. You know, the only adjustment you got, is, you know, is the LCD camera. Yeah, it seems to work out pretty good. All the wiring's on the outside. And got a little extension for the battery cord to the ESE. Only using one extension for the throttle control. Got the uh, servos inset, ins you know, down inside to keep them down as low as possible. Got some uh, zip ties, keeping that flimsy little wire from bending and bowing. Saw that on RC groups, it works good. Yep. Got a tapered triangle fuselage in the back. Fuselage sounds funny. Two and a half on the two sides and two inches on the top. Down to an inch and a half to two inches on the top. And, uh, yeah, it works great. A 20 inch horizontal stabilizer and I forget, that's a tall one though. Tall vertical. And over here, we got a 13 foot wing. 13 foot, 4 and a half inches to be exact. Oak, oak spar that I ripped from some uh, oak boards you got at Lowe's. And uh, yeah, they just. Insert like so. You know. I tape them together, good and tight. Not a whole lot of tapes, but three pieces, just to hold it on tight. Works great. And as you can see, clear across the other side of the deal. Let me get over here so you get a good look at it. That is a 13 foot long wing. Okay. Thanks for watching.